The first thing that worries us is that the, the, this impact of a minimum wage on agriculture um, is not observed in the other sectoral minimum wages that South Africa has also promulgated. So in domestic workers, for example, the, the employment effect is, um, is negligible. In um, some of the early results we're seeing on the other sectors, there's in fact no employment effect disemployment effect. So what worries us is are there other things going on? Well one thing we do know is that agriculture as a sector grew over the period of uh, pre and post the minimum wage. So agriculture itself hasn't sort of contracted in GDP terms. Um, it's possible that there may be other, um, the other factors in agriculture such as uh, um, complementary legislation if you like around labor tenancy and so on um, that uh, spooks the agricultural sector and so there's this um, move to getting rid of workers. It could be that what you're observing is a switching of a type of employment away from full-time employment towards third-party employment, temporary employment agencies, then providing farm workers to, uh, to farm employers. Um, so those explanations are all in the air but they're certainly possibilities.